Jakob, tell us about this final. You were in a good move with Julien and Philippe. I guess you had some memory of Strade Bianchi there. Uh, I told him already when we went away that he had to pull and this time I should win instead of him. But uh, it didn't work out. He didn't agree, so uh, yeah, now we ended up third and fourth. And you were surprised to see the group coming back like that in the final? Yeah, I was. I was. Uh, I said to them in the car when they, they, they didn't want to, to let me pull with Philippe anymore, which was kind of understandable. But on the other hand, I also said, then you need to give me the times to the to the group behind. And they, they tell me in the last kilometers that they're 20 seconds behind. I look behind me and I see Kierkowski at 10 meters. Like, that's not 20 seconds. You guys got, got it wrong. So, uh, so yeah. Um, it's a it's a little bit of sweet. I'm happy that I actually managed to get on the podium and the legs were there. But I still believe had I turned with with Ala Philippe uh, a little longer and and maybe maybe waited to play until the last kilometer, it could actually have turned out to be or it would have turned out to be minimum a second place instead of a third and and, and even a possible victory. But that's cycling, huh? For you, Ala Philippe made a mistake there. I don't know if he made a mistake. If I made a mistake, of course, he could also have, have, have gone all in. Uh, uh, I mean, in the end, he, he, is, he is the biggest loser of, of, of today. He would have, he would have had a, a, a big chance to win if he would have pulled, pulled on. And, and, and I mean, I, I still did the most of the work out there uh, from, from when he attacked. Uh, I was still the one who who was was putting in the most uh, the most effort uh, because he always said that he was fucked, but he he did the same in in Strade Bianca and there he still got me. So uh, yeah, that that's the game, that's the tactic.